Hey makers and engineers around the world, I hope you're doing fine in this you know, kind of situation. So today I'm gonna make a video on the WD963 um, soldering station. Now I just bought this today because I actually burned all my soldering irons. Now for years I've been using this kind of stuff, of course this isn't, didn't last me for a year, maybe around 3 months then I actually broke the resistance side of it and I couldn't find a replacement for it. Weird! I mean, the one who sold me, he said, no, we don't even sell this kind of stuff. So yeah, as you can see, totally busted. I just, I have no idea why, but I just broke the resistor in half here. So this is the only thing that I'm going to use is this tip. I think the tip here and in this one is compatible. So because I have a bunch of these lying around, which I bought from AliExpress, if you're wondering. So yeah, so I think it's gonna be cool. Now I think I'm gonna make two videos of this one right here. So the first one will be uh, an unboxing, and the f the second one will be a uh, tear down. So basically, I'm gonna take it apart and see the component inside of it because this is a Chinese. So I don't expect any good parts, you know, MOSFETs and that kind of stuff. So maybe we can upgrade it because I don't think this one has, uh, you know, an LCD, you only have a potentiometer. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just gonna find out. So let's see what's coming in the box. Now this is the first time I open it, so I only saw it in pictures, so yeah. So, uh, a manual in Chinese. <laughs> okay, so, well, they put the effort to put a manual, but why in Chinese? Okay, so if you don't understand Chinese, you then, you know, throw it in the junk. And yes, so the first one is the tip. Now, they put a nice cover, which I will throw in a moment. And yes, so um, as far as I know, this works on 12 volts, uh, actually 24 volts. Uh, so it plugs in this station. And the cool thing is you can find these for cheap. So let's say uh, you work on it for, I don't know, maybe a year and you broke it or something snap in half or something you can actually find a replacement for the whole uh, you know soldering iron or either you can just find a replacement for each part because as you can see the part itself yeah I told you it's compatible so yeah so uh, you can just buy a bunch of these from Aliexpress and okay so well, one pro note here you see this one is like it has like a pointy, you know, this thing is bad for uh, thermal conductivity, so you might as well throw this and buy something that looks like the one in the photo. So yeah, so let's just put this in and try not to break it. Okay, so let's just put this out of the way and let's... Okay, so I really like the, uh, you know, the... Uh, the packaging I think it's like it's it's going to uh, survive a throw or two you know in the car when transported ah, this thing is heavy I think there is a real big transformers this one I thought it uses like a switching power supply which I think it does not what's what's this is this like a price I ah, know it's just a bunch of notes okay so this is basically what's in the box Let's put this away and let's, you know, let's let's have a look at this one right here. So this is the support, and then it's all plastic. This is what you expect from, you know. I think uh, I paid this like uh, 100 uh, dinars, you know, if you live in Tunisia. So it's probably around 33 dollars US dollars. Now this is uh, metal. The, uh, I like this idea. I mean, they, they, they made the effort to put one sponge in here. Ah, oh, that's nice. So, all of this is plastic. This is metal and uh, you can take it apart. Ah, oh, cool. Uh, I don't really like the plasticky thing. I actually have this one, which is all metal. Uh, I don't know, but, but this one looks cooler. So, I'm gonna stick with these because, let's be honest, it looks way nicer than this one. I don't uh, know. I, I, I don't think... I don't think you can just... Wait. I uh, know. Wah, wah, wah. Yeah. Uh, th that was a fail. That was a fail. Anyway. So yeah, the cool thing about this is you can plug and play it. Oh, wait. Uh, okay. I'm, I'm gonna have to force it later. Oh, okay. It, it snapped. It, oh, no. Uh, anyway. 
Moving on. Okay, so let's put this. And this is the main dish. Okay, so it looks cool. It looks cool. And it's actually heavy. Wait, l l let me uh, bring my scale. Okay, let's have a look. How much this thing? Okay, so... Wow! It's it's one kilogram. Can you see it? Uh, I guess you can see it. It's 1.14 gram, actually kilograms. Ah, this thing is heavy. It's damn heavy. Okay, so... So, yeah, as I told you, there is no LCD right here. So, basically, if you want to change like the um, you know the temperature you need to just see the value I'm putting um, you know this is what you expect from 33 dollar you know but hey it doesn't feel really bad I mean it's all plastic yeah for sure but nah, it's, it's, I don't think it's bad I mean I can't really judge until I have a look at what's inside but really, why did they bother putting something like this? I mean, I mean, yeah, the, the, the matte finish is really cool, but this this thing is now... now I, I think I'm gonna remove it later, because, you know, it looks ugly. Never put black and white together. It's just disgusting. But I like the, the this gold here, yeah. So I think this is a red LED to, to stand that works. So here we have an input, 220, so this is uh, 45 watt, well, which is decent, I mean, I, I really wanted like 60, but it's going to do the job, and the output is 24, so basically here we have 24, uh, you know, it's, it's not really that bad. Okay, what's this here? There is a hole here. Did they want it to put something, they forgot about it? Mm, that's likely to happen with Chinese manufacturer, but uh, yeah, maybe does it breathe? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have to take it apart and see. Maybe the, you need to put something like it. Uh, you can put something here, or maybe a designer error or something like that. Uh, okay, so the potentiometer is a little wobbly. Yeah, definitely wobbly. I mean, yeah, you see. You hear this noise? Yeah, definitely what Okay, so <laughs> where do I put this again? Okay, I think. Okay, so yeah. So it goes like from 200, uh, so it goes from 200 uh, degree degrees to round. 480 so yeah it's not really bad I mean yeah it has uh, earth I'm not sure maybe this is not connected to earth I mean it's all plastic so why did they bother putting earth here I don't know maybe to yeah, it looks cool I mean I like I like I mean the, the cable feels good yeah definitely feels good no complaint here now overall I like this shape I like the shape of this one, so yeah, it's definitely a win. Now, of course, I need to power this up and make a few tests, like um, on a ground plane, to see the thermal conductivity here and there. Uh, but yeah, I don't really expect much from it. But overall, I think it was nice. So yeah, so uh, thanks for coming.